Hello YouTube, this is Frank from Architectural Aesthetics. Today in this video, I welcome you to the fifth episode and the mid-season finale of our Monuments in Watercolor series. The subject of today's video is the ruin of the Knossos Palace in today's Crete, Greece. As we idealize the Greek antiquity and praise it as the cradle of Western cultures, the ancient Greeks view the ancient Asian civilizations with the same admiration and longing. The Minoan civilization in particular achieved incredible heights in its economy, architecture, urban planning, and arts that people today marvel at how little we have progressed in terms of the various branches of social sciences comparing to our ancient predecessors. Long after the Minoan civilization's demise brought about by the fatalistic calamity, the influence of its art and architectures still permeates through folklores such as Homer's epic tales. For example, the insidious labyrinth which houses the monster Minotaur is undoubtedly inspired by the Minoan palaces, of which the most famous one being the Knossos Palace, which we are painting today. Brief introduction to the subject aside, the emphasis of today's video is still going to be the painting techniques and the experiences I gleaned from finishing this piece. Let's talk about the pencil framework stage first. Till this day, as we are 5 episodes in, I still think that this stage is the most important, yet also the most difficult step in the entire process. And it is so because laying down meticulous pencil framework isn't exactly a very rewarding activity, and there's really no shortcut in improving this skill rapidly. The only advice I have for those who seek to improve their freehand drawing skill is through a ton of practice and that during your practice, resist the urge of applying value or color prematurely when you're still not quite sure about the accuracy of your contours. As your drawing skills improve,
bitch. And I'll catch you at the very end of this video for a quick conclusion. Alright guys, so like I said before, this video is really a tribute to the fascinating Minoan civilization and the gist of the video has really been focusing on how to unify the composition through the manipulation of uh, different colored areas. And this video also concludes the fifth episode and the mid-season finale of our Monuments in Watercolor series. And with that said, please comment, like, share, and subscribe to the channel, and I'll see all of you in the next video. Bye-bye.